So we've just been uh, filming for a couple of days and how's it gone so far? No, that's what I thought too. <laughs> He's a real joker. We're Laura and Chris, and we left our home in Australia at the beginning of the year to travel right around the world for the adventure of a lifetime, beginning in South America. We've learned so much about ourselves and the world around us, but there have definitely been some major ups as well as some major downs. Last week, we left you at an animal shelter in northeastern Thailand called Save Souls Foundation. This week, we headed back down south to the mysterious Khao Sok National Park. Subscribe and welcome to the adventure. Good morning. We are off to Khao Sok National Park today. It's a whole day trip. It starts at about 8.30, ends at five o'clock, and we get to go to the lake and do some hiking. So it should be a good day. So we booked our tour through the Royal Bamboo Lodge today, and it hasn't been the cheapest of ventures, but it worked out to be about $73 per person. So it's proven to be an expensive day, but you'll understand why it is well worth it when we explain what this place is. Why you, you go straight to okay. buy that one, yeah, or going to. Oh, I hate car rides. <laughs> we've been taking lots of long car rides lately. But we've arrived at the entrance to Kaosok National Park and we're just waiting to get on our long tail boat to go from there on the lake. This is our ride. About to go into the cave. Into the cave. Ready? We got our headlamps. Mm -hmm. We'll be careful. Oh, can't get it on. We've been touring around for about half an hour to an hour. Haven't really stopped yet, but this is the first stop. And we're about to go into a cave. And they've given us all the little headlamps. Make sure mine works. Works. No, you haven't. No, no, we're videoing. Sorry. Shit. Oh, already. Already. Jesus. All right. Then how many watches and viewers do you guys get on your YouTube channel? Like millions. Millions and millions. Don't tell her. Don't tell her. Don't tell her. No. Be careful with your head. You are step. Yes. Will we get eaten alive in there? Okay. Come. By mosquitoes or? Ah, uh, for stalag. Uh, stalag Thai, stalag might inside the cave. Do it. This place is insane. It's about twenty thousand years old. We're only walking like 50 meters into the cave. And there's lots of bats. <laughs> <laughs> and there's lots of bats. Lots of bats. After making it out of the cave, we hopped back on our boat to Frog Island to see more of the beautiful lake.
Older and wiser than the Amazon rainforest of South America, Cow Sock is home to 5% of the world's biodiversity and is reportedly more than 160 million years old. Covered by the oldest evergreen rainforest in the world, it has survived and remained relatively unchanged throughout the ice ages due to the massive amount of rainfall this region receives each year. Chowland Lake has also been lucky enough to escape any major pollution as it is protected by the surrounding communities and environmental organisations. We are sadly leaving the island now because as you can maybe see, it's starting to get really dark, so we need to head back. Our guide said we can't really get trapped in the rain, and we are gonna head back to the car and get back to our resort for some food. And a very good morning to everybody once again. Good morning. We finished up with cow sock, uh, as a matter of fact, a couple of days ago. Yeah, we haven't really left our little town or resort area in almost two days, so we figured it was time to get up a little bit earlier and go on a little bit of a hike today. Right, our bungalows this morning told us that there's no point doing it at this time. She said you should have done it at six o'clock this morning, but we couldn't get. We're going to prove her wrong. Early. We're going to prove her wrong. Hiking buddy this morning. We just can't seem to really let go of the whole hanging out with dogs, hanging out with dogs thing. <laughs> Our lady at the bamboo lodge told us that it's going to be 10, 10 kilometers to walk from where we're staying to the viewpoint. But this bloke on the side of the road says, go right up here, it's only four kilometers. So, 10 minutes in. National Park. It's a little bit foggy so you can't see as much but it's still good because we're gonna think of it as it was our exercise for the day. We've been walking around for the past half an hour trying to find Monkey Temple and I think we're right in front of it. Oh there are monkeys! We've just debated on whether or not we should get food to feed them, but I really don't think my insurance is going to cover monkey bites because we were feeding them. We don't have any food. So we've just been uh, filming for a couple of days and how's it been gone so far? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No. No, that's what I thought too. <laughs> He's a real joker. <laughs> Please send help.
What are you doing? You just perched up there? Yep. Just eating. You're my new buddy.